Good morning, Mr. Fran. Hey, how you doing? I am wonderfully blessed as always. Thank you so much. And so are you. And you're blessed for starring in this wonderful, wonderful film. I am. Well said. <laughs> I really am. This movie is amazing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I feel I'm incredibly grateful. Yeah. Well, you know what, what I like about this film? It made me laugh and it scared the yeah. heck out of me to, you know, difficult things to do in a horror film is to make you laugh and scare yeah. at the same time, right? Yeah, I, it's it's wild, and I, I've I've had the pleasure of seeing it with some audiences, and I've seen it myself. But it, I, I've never really quite seen anything like this. That that people are are screaming, they're terrified, they're shocked, but they, they, it's they're laughing. It's this kind of uh, wild elation, uh, and, and I, it's a it's just a great sort of a emotion and and feeling that this movie's producing. It's it's really kind of wonderful, pure entertainment, and it's so it's so original. I, I think audiences kind of sit there with their jaws dropped, uh, uh, kind of blown away by what what's happening. It's really great. It is a amazing blend of the sort of two genres. It's wonderful. Right. Um. You came from the Whedon universe as well with Dollhouse. Yeah. Is that the main attraction? for you to joining the cabin in the woods? Well, I, I was working with uh, Joss Whedon on Dollhouse when I first auditioned for it and read the script, and I expected a lot from him. I, I already was so Im impressed with his work and, and, and was a fan myself. That, uh, but, but reading the script with, with Drew Goddard involved as well, it really exceeded my expectations. You know, I, I would work with those guys uh, in a heartbeat, but, but with this, they really, they really dug even deeper and found something even even more special than than what I, I what I would have expected. Um, it's it's so original, it's so different, and uh, and it managed to stay that way throughout the whole process. You know, which is uh, which is incredible, which is very rare, more rare than I think audiences realize. Right now, the movie tagline says, "You may think you know the story, but you don't." Yeah. A fitting description of the movie, right? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of. I mean, it's kind of perfect. It's pretty simple. It's sort of, it, but it, but it is kind of perfect. Um, you know, the simplicity of the title is, is 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 somewhat of a decoy. I mean, certainly there is a cabin and there are woods. There are five kids that go in and bad things happen. But what those things are, are, are not what you'd expect. And uh, I don't want to give things away because. The less you know, the better, truly. But at the same time, there are so many twists and so many turns. It's not just one thing. I couldn't, I, we, will, we don't have time for me to actually ruin the movie. You know what I mean? <laughs> I, I believe that. There's, you know, seriously, you know, there's so many layers uh, 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 to this movie that, you know, I, I'm, I feel very confident people are going to enjoy it no matter what they've heard or, or they, might, they, they think they might know, you know? No, let's talk about your character quickly. You are the, the, the quote unquote, the stoner of the film. How did you get into that yeah. character? What have you been smoking? <laughs> uh, I know this is what. I, yeah, no, I I actually did go to uh, what they called pot school. Um, <laughs> a lot of the actors had to do some kind of training. There's a lot of action in the movie, some motorcycles, some scuba diving. Uh, but my character, I, what I had to do during the rehearsal process, I'd, I'd go to the production office and just smoke uh, different fake kinds of, of marijuana and roll joints and. Use figure out the the coffee thermos bong contraption. I mean, truly, that is how I spent my mornings for about two weeks. While in the afternoon, we'd rehearse the scenes and, and get a sense of the blocking and what we were gonna do. So it was not your typical uh, uh, rehearsal process. I'm 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 pretty sure I'll never do anything like that again. It, it, it was a really fun, unique character. But you know, he is the stoner. He is the slacker. But he's very intelligent. I like to think of him as, as Shaggy meets Scooby. You know, he's sort of he's he's suspicious. He knows he's uh, he, he he's aware that something is not the way it should be. And, and so it was a lot of fun to play. It was a total gift as for an actor. You know what? I'm a self-confessed Josh Whedon fan, and this is what I like about his yeah, work. From Buffy the Vampire Slayer all the way to The Cabin in the Woods, he loves breaking the notion. He loves breaking our preconceived notion of what the genre is, and then have fun with it. Right. Yeah, I mean, I, I, you know, he's he's like he's become almost synonymous uh, with, with that. Or, or, or when you think Joss Whedon, you you believe that there will be some original take on on what genre he's 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 taking on next. Um, so with Cabin in the Woods, I I, I assumed I, I uh, there would be something different, but he 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 exceeded it. He definitely blew me away. But. No, that, that is sort of the beauty of him, and I think why he has such great fans and loyal fans and loyal employees, why people want to work with him. And, and he and Drew together are such an amazing one-two punch. They, you know, they bring 
they bring so much creativity and imagination to their work that uh, you know when you see Cabin in the Woods, you'll 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 understand that uh, it's it's two amazing original minds uh, coming together. It's a kind of wonderful harmony that they're creating with this movie, and and I, I I'm very confident that audiences are going to enjoy it. I mean I've I've seen it a lot now, several times, and I still <laughs> still get excited to see it again. Really, oh, it's great. so do I. I will be back first thing tomorrow morning, Friday when it opens. But thank you so much yes, again. Good do. luck on everything, Mr. Fran. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. Bye.